Welcome to a couple of spare parts found on this boat one of our clients just purchased. On the left is a fuel filter, in the middle is a fuel filter, and on the right is an oil filter. You can't feel the cardboard boxes, but they're damp. We inspected each of these, and looking here at this Bosch oil filter, we found all of this rust in the top. Trash. Throw it away. Don't try to clean it up. You don't want that rust getting inside the engine of your boat. Next is a CAV type of diesel fuel filter. This is a three-part filter where you actually have the lid that goes on top of the filter, a different lid that goes on the bottom of the filter, and then the filter in the middle. And of course, it's made of steel, and that's wet, and you can see that that's ruined. Throw it away. And last in this video, we have a generator filter. This is another fuel filter, and you don't want any of that rust getting inside your fuel system. Remember, the injectors are actually atomizers. Think of a can of spray paint or a can of hairspray. If the sprayer nozzle atomizer gets clogged up, then you don't get anything to come out of the atomizer or it comes out in big drips. So to make your boat run well, just throw away this trash. If you're buying a used boat and you get all of these used filters with the boat, inspect every one of them when you do your inventory. Trash, trash, trash. There's no way you can save it. These filters retail for about 10 to 15 bucks a piece, so it's not a lot of money. Be smart. Learn how to do maintenance on your own boat. And one place you can learn more about do-it-yourself maintenance is with us in Vero Beach where we have our introduction to boat maintenance systems. Ask Captain Chris. Learn more how you can do your own diesel fuel filter changes and also your own oil filter changes. Ask Captain Chris.